Hello, I am Mal, and welcome back to Master of Orion Early Access. Let's play as the Human Republic. So we're in a little bit of a bind now. Uh, I think we'll be able to make our way out, but uh, as I thought would happen, um, the Cylons did declare war on us. I actually thought it was going to be the, the Sakura to do it first, but uh, nope. Our quote-unquote friends, the Cylons, decided to go to war. Uh, and that's okay. Like I said, I think we'll be able to handle it. Uh, they have, um, fairly decent tech, but we just got some breakthroughs like with shield technology and other things, which will help immensely. So let's see here. Enacted a blockade. Okay. Now, all we can hope to do on a fight like this is just to take out some of their ships. That's why I went ahead and put um, these missile defenses here so that we'd have something so they couldn't just, you know, bombard the planet right away. And we'll speed this up. Okay, hold on. Let's change target. Do you have those class 3 shields, which will help? Yeah, it did. It helped a lot, actually. We're actually gonna get another salvo off. That was nice. Now, will we get any more than that? Probably not. Oh, we did better than I thought we would. Still think they're gonna win, but destroying three of their ships was good. Are we gonna pull this off? Yeah, our shields are regenerating. Class three shields, yep. That's what saved us. Oh, that was awesome. Nice. Good job, missile base. Good job. Okay, that was sweet. You're at max pop? Okay. Do you already have a missile base? You do? You already have a star base? Okay, then you go ahead and work on terraforming then. Should be able to get our ship here at the same time if they decide to attack. So between the defenses here plus the ship, we'll be able to win that battle, I think, without too many problems. Lucian's getting a bit high here. Let's go ahead and grab an atmospheric renewer, and then... I guess we'll do some pollution cleanup here. I mean, we're going to have to do it at some point, so we might as well do it. Oh, <laughs> that troop transport got up there finally. Um, let's let's have those rally down here, I guess. Oh, dang it! How did they cross the system and get to me before I could move to the planet? That was a little odd. All right, well, we'll do the best we can. It's five on one. Of course, we have the bigger class ship, so we might be able to pull it off. Said it was a balanced fight, so we'll see. What I could do is engage and then sort of retreat and go behind some of these asteroids. Okay, pause.
Yeah, we're gonna take a turn here. Whoa, hey now. Come on. Nah, they got me. That would have worked, I think, better if I had made the turn a little sooner. Alright, fair enough. A cat may look on a king, but it doesn't have to stop there. Ask us to refrain from claiming more territory? Like, what are you going to enforce that with? Like, that, it doesn't even make any sense for them to be asking us anything. We stopped one planet from decimating their entire empire. Or actually devastating, right? Because decimate would be ten, mm, but you know what I'm saying. I just can't seem to make up my mind. I would designate myself for the position. I choose none. You choose none? He's so cool. I vote for humanity. All right, threatening fleet detected. Group transport, okay. It's factory. This deal over here, yep, yep. Got another cruiser over here. And I think every colony has defenses at this point. Okay, you're a research planet, so... Grab that spaceport because we might as well. And then. I'll grab the hydroponics first. Who needs orders? You do. Okay, so you're done with the military outposts. Let's go build another one over here. Welcome to GNN. And now, the state of the galaxy. Current number of colonies. Oh, I didn't realize we were that far ahead of them, colony-wise. Yeah, so if we can keep them, if we can keep this offensive from the Cylons at bay, we should be good to go. Yeah, especially now that we've got extra ships showing up. Yeah, okay, so let's take this destroyer and head here. You know what? Send the troop transport. Right there. GNN, Galactic News Network. A colony has detected the beginning of the gravitational collapse of their star. The whole system hangs in the balance as their star... Not one of ours, right? No, it's this one over here. Well, sucks to be you guys. Are you going to withdraw that? Take a look at military between us and the Cylons. 
Oh, you don't have much left, do you? Okay, good. If I may have a moment. We'll have to do some pollution cleanup before we can finish that, huh? Alright. You're at max pop again? Okay. Do civil transport. Actually, let's finish your terraforming project, then we can go back to the destroyer. Yeah, you're withdrawing to go get repairs, I'm assuming. That's fine with me. While you do that, I'll fortify these locations. And then you're screwed, pal. Then I'm gonna come for your face. Yep, you're gonna head there. Another destroyer. You head there to Kita. Build a civil transport. Where are you headed? Over here, huh? They've got a smattering of destroyers. They've got a couple of troop transports, but they don't really have anything to write home about. Nothing very impressive, so... We should be okay, as long as the Sakras stay out of it. I move up here now. I think I stay where I'm at. Just do this upgrade. Transport. Let's head here, the rest of the fleet. Mm-hmm. Oh, you're bringing everything over, huh? Okay. Base Factory's done with that project. So we want to come down here and secure this one. We need to go take this system from them. This is GNN. 
Galactic News Network. After a harrowing race again. All right, so they stopped the event. That's fine. Our scientists. Jump gate. Yeah, scientists. that's what I'm talking about. Okay, now choose research. Dauntless guiding would be good. Ground batteries. Actually, Astro University would probably be more u more beneficial. So let's grab that. Now we can start building jump gates everywhere. Let's build another factory. So. We want to leave you there for defense? Yeah, I think that makes sense. Okay. Yeah, see, he knows we're coming for him. You're gonna be a research world? Yep. Probably. Grab a star base. You don't have a missile base either? Seriously? Oh, you're... Where are you at? You're down here, right? Oh, that's why. Because you're kind of behind the wall, so to speak. Base, missile base, marine barracks. Okay. Wanted to double check because this thing's kind of isolated over here. We'll build a military outpost here and then we'll back up and we'll put a jump gate over here. Then I'll start backfilling the other systems with jump gates to speed things up. That's so, so beneficial. It makes a huge difference, actually. Being able to move your stuff around with much greater flexibility. Okay, actually, I'm going to grab another space factory. And... Another cruiser. Yep. Okay, then you're gonna do fungal farm. This, we'll grab that. And then we'll have you terraform. Grab a civil transport. There we go, we got a nice little fleet going here now. Move this troop transport up here. Another destroyer. Okay, you're gonna stay in this system actually. Bend. You're gonna build a jump gate. Thank you very much. Okay, 
Got to keep an eyeball on this system primarily. Okay. What have I built here already in terms of Production, automated factory, neutron collider. So I've kind of already committed to building other stuff here. Grab a missile base, marine barracks. Yeah, we'll finish that stuff up and then terraform here. I'll keep you busy for a good long while. We don't need that. You're at 100% morale. Pollution's okay. You've got defenses. Build another cruiser? Yeah, might as well. You got the command points, so... Might as well use it. A couple of these ships need repairs, but that'll be taken care of as soon as this is done. And then we can go start taking their planets as they decided they wanted to fight. What's this worth now? 5,000? Okay, that's nice. That's a pretty good defense. So I'm feeling pretty comfortable about this particular front. Now I just need to shoot up the, the defense right here. I need a couple of ships that I can sit on this military outpost and bounce back and forth to either one if I need it. Though, I don't think they could take those planets from me anyway. They could blockade them, that's about the best they can do. Ah, eh, we don't really need cloning. Um... Colonial Revenue Services, Research Lab, Moon Laboratory, come on, grab everything, there we go. What do I want to send to you? Um, back over here, I guess? Yep, that'll work. Oh, Astro University is done. Nice. Our scientists are eager to start. What should we focus on? Interplanetary administration would be nice to have. But since we're still building up stuff and not ready to do export on mo most of those worlds, I think I'm better off just grabbing like this for Dauntless Guidance System. Yeah, let's do that. Fantastic. The Dauntless Guiding System, if, you, if you're not familiar with that, allows your missiles to retarget after they've already, uh, like say a target's destroyed, and you've got a bunch of missiles heading towards it, it can then redirect those missiles to a different target. Pretty darn helpful. Let's see. What upgrade?
24,000. It's pretty solid. All things considered. Okay, now. Space factory. Move over here. Give us a jump gate, please. Gravity generators here. That'll make a huge difference when that's done. Okay, looks like they're putting a fleet together over here. Is that what you're trying to do? Mm-hmm. 11,000. That's not going to be enough to save you, guys. Not going to be enough to save you. So we'll grab the Neutron Collider. Research lab, because reasons. And then... Terraform? Okay, space factory. Right there, and... Jump gate, please. Jump gate here is done. Go down here and we'll build another one. Best to just build them everywhere. And since it does take a point now, which I which I, I'm glad that it does, I know some people disagree with this design choice, but I think it makes sense that the jump gate is on, you know, a warp point. Um, make sure that you, you know, think about okay, this like for instance, in this system, I've got a potential threat from this direction. I've got a potential threat from this direction. I've got three warp points, and the jump gate's valid for moving ships in and out of this system, regardless of what point it's on, right? So this far point back here and allowing the other two to be military outposts is the way you're going to want to set that up. In other words, I don't want to jump gate right here because I could be attacked from here. I want the military outpost there. And so jump point in the back is a safer bet. And truce has expired, huh? Okay. They're afraid. They're hostile. They're afraid. Okay, so they should not... They should not go to war with me. That should be an okay deal there. Matter of fact... Hello. We do a trade treaty? Marked and numbered. Did that mean you, you did it? Yes, okay. That's fine. We can get a little extra money from that. Before we pound their faces in later. Alright, so let's do this. Let's build a spaceport and then do pollution cleanup. Okay, folks. I think I'm gonna end this one here. Maybe get a couple more turns of repair. No, no, we're good. Okay, well, we'll move forward. And I will go ahead and end this one here, and in the next one, We'll start trying to take some of these Cylon planets. Yep. This looks good. We'll take this one from them right away. <laughs> anyway, I hope you enjoyed this one. If you did, please consider hitting that thumbs up. Thanks so much for watching, and until next time, I am Mal, and I will see you later.